Ladies and gentlemen, what is going on? Welcome back to World of Tanks and World of Tanks Epic Battle episode. Where today I'm going to feature one tank that you haven't seen in my Epic Battle episodes before. You have seen T1 e 4 on my channel many many times before, but you haven't seen that piece in any Epic Battle episodes. Uh, so let's check this out, because the title of the replay was interesting. Uh, the title of the replay was uh, check out this epic heavy tank T110 E5. Not E5, god damn, E4. Uh, the title of the email was actually that uh, and check out this first shot. 745 damage done plus fire. And seems like M48 pattern doesn't have fire extinguishers. So first shot, 1480 damage done that we can actually see. A little bit extra damage done I believe, but... Uh, but it was, uh, yeah, this guy disappeared, so almost 1,500 damage done, and oh my god, that shot was close. Let's see that once again. So T-34 is closing in. <laughs> my god, that was super close, like 0 0.01 seconds. Ah, I don't know. Anyways, let's get back into the action. ISU has been spotted, blind shot, and seems like... That might have been a hit, because I assume kept backing up. Okay, let's hope that was actually a blind hit. Uh, but uh, this game is played by Phantom081 from the clan called CSA3. So, yeah, I don't know if uh, this game uh, play was sent to me by Phantom as well, because it has uh, no connection to the username over here. But just in case, I'm uh, not going to reveal your email address and your real name or, or something. That was a little bit bad shot. I don't know why you didn't go for the turret shot or the body shot under the turret. Gives you a higher chance to hit anything. And you got actually spotted and CDC is shooting you. But you do not give a damn that ISU has to go down. 732 damage done. And guess what guys? Two fires in a row. And this guy once again doesn't have fire extinguisher. What are the odds? Two fires in one game and they both do not carry fire extinguishers. One more shot needed and into the turret. Headshot, enemy armor has been destroyed. Uh, so uh, 3, 000, exactly 3000 damage done that we can see. But most likely that ISU was actually a blind hit. So, so let's see. Maybe CDC is going to be able to spot him once again. And oh yeah, <laughs> into the tracks. Nothing more, nothing less. Uh, this position for uh, T110E4 is actually really amazing because you can literally hi hide your hull entirely and uh, the only thing that they can see is your turret. And turret for stuff like ISU is pretty much impenetrable. T30, trying to hide, but he's not going to work. 730 damage done. And let's just keep backing up. So yeah, this, uh, this guy is out of the position. Driver dead. Sneaky CDC. This guy has to be somewhere up there. Oh, hello, Leopard. Come on, reload. Nope. Just in time. This guy almost like new. Track damage. Yeah, I believe it is better to back up. And as we can see, Phantom definitely knows what he's doing with its uh, T110E4 because of two Mark of Excellences. Two Mark of Excellence stars on the gun. It's just beautiful. Just beautiful. So lower plate is pretty easy and penetratable. I believe that shot uh, was uh, into the lower plate was by that leopard one. CDC did hit our turret and kill driver. KH loaded in for that leopard. Good thinking. If we actually had a shot, then it would have been pretty sexy amount of time it's done. Anyways, let's go over the um, rounds as well. Uh, so 295 penetration with standard shot and uh, 750 average damage. With premium shot, 375 penetration. But 295 penetration is more than you need almost always. So uh, with T110E4, uh, tier 10 heavy tank. <laughs> Uh, yeah, you do not need to carry that many Primo shots. Seven, or oh, not seven, 441 damage done with HE shell. That HE shell was actually for Leopard 1 and CDC. Good job, no damage done. And as you can see, E4's armor is actually quite terrible. Uh, how many shots? Six shots bounced. 
in a row. E75 is dead. CDC. White annoying bugger. Oh, hello leopard. Come on, HE work. Oh yes, and third fire. And guys, third guy in a row who was put on fire didn't carry fire extinguisher. What a day to be alive. Really, what a day to be alive. Epic shot into the leopard, one shot and uh, 1,525 uh, damage done in total. Well, most likely that leopard is carrying two repair kits because uh, leopard is known for its uh, weak uh, Amorak and, and all the module damage. So, a lot of you guys are carrying the two repair kits, uh, small repair kit and large repair kit with leopard PJ and leopard 1. So, I'm not going to charge. I believe if we're going to be able to penetrate... CDC with HG shell. This guy is going to be one shot, but uh, AP rounds are in at the moment. Now, oh, this guy is really annoying. Literally sniping. He's not doing anything else, literally just sniping. And it is working. I have to say it is working. Because this guy is simply really annoying. Almost exactly the average roll. 759. Ooh, CDC received some damage. That means IS-4. Yes, IS-4 is pushing him. You were able to tell it by that. IS-4 was there before. <laughs> A little bit under average damage to that IS-4, 725. And this shot did put him uh, down to one shot. Down to being a one shot. So, not too bad. Not too bad. CDC has been spotted once again. But nothing that we can actually do. Oh, come on. Oh, 867 damage done. In two, this was literally pixel hunting into the commander hats. 867 damage done, yeah. This is classic pixel hunt. I do not understand why he's not going for that CSC. Maybe he's too afraid of IS-4 and E-15M camping. Yeah, actually could be. But Phantom is playing smart over here. He definitely cannot be too aggressive because he's too shot. If IS-4 is going to be able to penetrate him and if E-15M is going to be able to penetrate uh, Phantom's armor, then uh, this is GG for him. And ooh, this guy's actually moving. Come on, come on, your chance. No. A little bit too late. Sadly, our CDC missed. Oh, IS-4 is over here. Come on. What are you going to do? Full late speed E-30. They still have full HP D30. Well, not so full HP anymore. Seems like 263 is going to be able to kill him. Or to deal some damage to him. And uh, hello! One shot into the pooper. He's going to do it. IS-4 has been destroyed. And this game should be in the bag now. Nothing that uh, one shot E5 gem can do. And on the move. Nope. Let's make it sure. A little quick stop. And yes, this game is going to be in the bag. AMX CDC, D49 and D30 left. D30 is actually one shot, so... Let's make it happen. Goodbye. 611 damage done. That badass CDC finally went down. And actually, if I'm going to think about it, that Centurion action X played really good. It was a really good decision to stay back and to wait for us to see what is going on in the city. And as soon as he saw that IS-4 and, and E5M are out from the position, he went for that uh, CDC. So really well played battle by that uh, action X as well. But anyways, guys, let's see what Phantom was able to get for this kind of battle. A tanker, obviously, 5200 experience. 114,000 credits, uh, Radley Walters for 8 kills, Steel Wall, High Caliber and Top Gun. Uh, close to 11,000 damage done. 8 kills, 1,597 experience. As I said, really good battle by our Centurion Action X as well, so good job. On the enemy side, I afforded a really good job and that sniping AMX CDC, man. 
How annoying was that? 18 shots fired, 17 hits, 16 penetrations, uh, pretty decent ratio, damage blocked by armor, uh, 1910. And as we can see, you're able to make credits with tier 10 destroyer, 69,000 credits, uh, because Phantom didn't fire a single Primus shot in this battle. You usually do not need to use Primus shots when you have 295 penetration. So to go on the D1 to any 5 is actually quite enjoyable, really. That roll and, and <laughs> three fires without fire extinguishers. RNG Jesus loves dude or loved you that tape. So Phantom, I thank you for this kind of epic battle and I hope you guys enjoyed today's epic battle episode as well. If you did, leave it. Uh, leave the thumbs up button clicked down for Phantom maybe. And if you didn't, leave that thumbs down button clicked down. Whatever floats your boat. Take care and bye.